Good evening and welcome to the presentation for the mathematics department here at Cardinal Hara High School. My name is Jim Stinger. It's my honor to represent our department as the chair. Uh, I work with a fine group of teachers up on the third floor, come up and visit us anytime. Um, and uh, we make a really good team, I believe. So let's get to it with the course sequencing for uh, our department. At Cardinal Hauer, we uh, have a sequencing that goes Algebra 1, Algebra 2, and then Geometry. I think the thought behind that is you get two good solid years of all those algebra skills that you can apply uh, at those next levels. And uh, I think it serves our students uh, well. There, we have some plan. We have some plans about doubling up that we'll talk about in a little bit. If that's something that you're interested in, but let's just focus on uh, the sequencing right here. Uh, in the blue, you can see the pathway that would lead you to an AP course, whether it's calculus or statistics. Uh, the gateway for that would be coming through this pre-calculus honors class. That would be a necessity there. Again, but we have courses that can match. Uh, the abilities and goals of all our students here. As you can see, a statistics class and a honors calculus class to get um, some great experience before heading off to college. Um, so we have a lot of good choices here, as you can see. I'll leave it up there for a second for you to take a look. And so let's continue here. Let's talk a little bit about the calculus curriculum. Two courses at the AP level. We have Calculus AB, and for 2021, there will be no clearing test uh, under the circumstances we all find ourselves in. That's something that might return in the future, but for now, uh, again, we'll take a look at the list. We'll consider their track record in classes. Um, SAT scores could be a delineator, but we'll just see how it goes with the sign up. Um, but again, uh, when considering AP calculus class, number one, you are signing up for taking the AP exam in May. That is a definite. And also, again, since this is a, a full year of college level calculus in the high school uh, calendar year, um, you're going to really commit to about 45 minutes of calculus homework. Uh, if that's going to become successful. And uh, so you're making that commitment. Uh, we do have some people at the underclass level that take AP Calculus AB. And as seniors, they're going to take the AP Calculus BC class. And uh, we've had great success with many students over the years in that part of the program. We also offer statistics and AP statistics with the major themes being these things right here, collecting data, describing data, probability, and the concept of inference. There will be projects in these classes. And again, when you commit to that AP statistics class, you're committed to taking an AP exam in May. And again, um, the pacing of that requires really a dedicated uh, homework for statistics in that 45 minute range to be successful. So you are making that commitment when you sign up for this class. For those who have the goal of taking a statistics or calculus class at the high school level, many times that's a goal in terms of getting that on a resume, right? For a successful uh, college placement. Um, what we really suggest here, O'Hara, is when we're going to uh, suggest a double up, so that would be necessary for a student who comes in maybe at Algebra 1. So Algebra 2, Geometry, Pre-Calc is, is necessary to get to those things. So you're going to have to have a double up at that point. Um, so in, at our school, we really believe the best course to double up would be Geometry with Pre-Calculus. You've got those two years, two successive years of algebra, algebra one, algebra two, setting you up for success with pre-calculus. And that's something you can simultaneously do with geometry, with the uniqueness of ge geometry. And we feel that's the best way to do that. All double ups uh, should be in complete consultation with your teacher 
and often the department chair myself needs to be um, included in that conversation and those can happen over the next couple of weeks. Any mathematics teacher in our department is an expert and they can answer your questions regarding sequencing. Uh, if you have a specific calculus related question, that's probably best directed to Miss Lee Keller, who does a wonderful job with that class. And any statistics related questions uh, directed to Mr. Mark Manier, who does a wonderful job with that class as well. I'm here to help as well. If you have any questions, you can always get in touch with me. And uh, that's basically our program for this evening. So thank you very much. Uh, we appreciate uh, you paying attention. And if you, again, if you have any questions, you can get a hold of me. Thank you.